It would have to be William Eggleston. Uh, I think that's probably quite a lot of people's favourite photographer. The fact that you have no idea whether it is uh, completely just off the cuff or whether it's been um, very carefully formulated and staged. Uh, each uh, you know, and every exhibition I've seen of his, um, there's always something new, there's always something different, but it's always very identifiably Eggleston. So I, I just find him extraordinary. It's become the language, I think, of today, and it's so omnipresent that we don't even recognize that it's photography, which is kind of challenging for people who teach photography, because people are like, photography? What? But it's everywhere, right? We send one another pictures all the time. Um, but of course, it's always been the means by which we remember, you know, the means by which we take something away from a place we love or a person we love. So many things in academia you only learn secondhand. And what I love about photography and teaching photography, which I do, is that you get your students out there and they have to meet the people, they have to be in the places, they have to experience the world firsthand. And it serves as testimonial to things we don't love and don't want to look at. It forces us to look at things. Uh, and of course it serves all kinds of narratives that are probably not true uh, because it can be manipulated so easily. Um, I am a photographer, so for me, uh, it began as a means of collecting the world, and it's become a means for talking about the world. One of the main benefits of photography is it gets you into the space, and it connects you with the people and the world and the planet in ways that painting or sculpture doesn't really let you do. It's an interesting time to be teaching in a photography program because it has become second nature. Everyone has a camera in their pocket. And I think what we need to learn how to do is to talk about the way that photography is not a, a medium or a process. It's a way of sort of understanding and parsing the world. I like photography. So. Yeah. <laughs>